So one of the downsides of Figma is it's a static design tool. And if you are someone who is a visual designer or has some images or videos you want to put on your site, how would you do it? So luckily, Jacqueline has provided us with GIFs that look like this, but also an MP3 version of what she wants as well. Now we can add MP3s and GIFs to the web. It's pretty straightforward. Now what I've just done is uploaded these. So I have my Connie.gif and the Connie.mp4 file. How do we add this in? Now luckily for GIFs, it's really, really quick. All I need to do is just change what I need. So in my grid layout, for instance, I'm just gonna change it to Connie.gif and we'll just automatically get it on the site. So here we go, it's added as a wave. Now, the other thing that we might wanna do is change it for a video. So how do we do this? Now, this is obviously not an image, it's a video. And here we've got Connie.mp4, but it looks pretty much kind of the same, to be honest. So I'm just gonna get rid of this image and instead replace it with a video tag. Now, a video tag has stuff it can go inside of it. So for instance, there could be more sources of the video. But here, I'm just gonna keep it empty and instead move back to the O in video. Got my cursor just after it. And I wanna pull this in like I would pull in an image. So not just the image, Connie.gif, we wanna pull in Connie.mp4. So we're gonna add a space in here and do SRC, source. We're gonna pull it in. This is gonna be equal to, in quotes, Connie.mp4. Now, if we look at the page right now, what we'll see is the video there. It's pretty big. How do we make it a little bit smaller? Well, we want to size it up. We want it to just fill the space it's in. So I'm just going to go back to my style.css and I'm just going to say all videos for now are just going to be the width of the container, 100%. So what we should see now is this goes back to where it should do. But at the moment, it doesn't play. So how do we make it auto play? What we can do is add some extra information to this video tag. So what we can say in my index.html is after my source, but before we close this angle tag, I'm gonna do a space. I'm also gonna add in things like autoplay, which means that it will autoplay. And it's not doing at the moment. So why is this not autoplaying at the moment? Well, there's more stuff that we need to add in. Also, what we need to put in is plays in line. So this just means that we can play it in line. If we did want to add more things to this, now at the moment, if I just refresh, you'll notice that it plays really quick, but then it disappears because it's then, see it played, but didn't loop. If I want to make this loop, I need to add in the word loop, of course. So now it should just play. Now, if I do want to play this on mobile, we have to make this muted by default. So if I'm on a mobile and I want to play this almost like a GIF, I do have to make this muted. So this would now then play. If I just want to play it as a normal video, all I need to do is add in all of these. It can go and I can add in controls. So here what we have is this play button. I can just press play. We have this uh, sound, we can make it full screen. So there's a few different options that we can do with videos that we can't do with GIFs. So this, it's up to you which one you use. If this is gonna be replacement for a GIF, it would look something like this. If you just want it as a normal video, you'd add just the word controls in there. So it depends on what video you want to play here.